it's time to make a potion to invite our fairy friends. First, we need a dish, bowl, mug, or pot, thrifted from a secondhand store or passed down from an ancestor, and a wooden spoon. You'll need a piece of beautiful colored paper to cut into a fancy shape. You choose. And a magical pen or marker. Pluck inspiration from your heart in the form of an affirmation. Write it onto the paper. Place it into the dish. Now sprinkle dried lavender and a pinch of sage. Light a wand of Palo Santo Wave it counterclockwise over your heart and the container. You are opening fairy portals. Read your affirmation out loud, softly and sweetly to the Fay Queendom. Take a sip of water. Drop a chamomile petal into the bowl or mug with a grateful spirit. Your childlike glee glittering through your eyes say thank you, it is so. Light your Palo Santo wand again and circling clockwise now, closing the portal. Your Fae Potion is complete. Do this on a full moon to magnetize its power. A tiny fairy. Was it really? I believed until my mind started to play tricks on me. In the forest, minding my own business, enjoying the magic of the day. When a flash of colored light, blue or purple, I can't quite remember, an orb moving fast. Yet at the exact moment when it was directly in front of me, in slow motion, we made eye contact before it vanished into plain sight. I screamed, I saw a fairy. The girls looked at me, not surprised, as they too were enchanted and could believe. I saw a fairy, didn't I? My mind now trying to believe what my soul eyes saw, but could not explain. A fleeting moment of magic is all that remains. No proof of the encounter, only a mind that claims make-believe. Yes, make-believe. You must make belief inside of yourself if you are to believe. That afternoon in a forest, one I've never stepped into before and haven't since, in the Berkshires of Massachusetts, a visit from a fairy, a day I'll never forget. I pray for you each and every day, my fairy friends, the wise and playful, loving and kind, magical and divine elemental folk, a forest, stream, rock, fungi, flower, and fauna. I pray for you as if you will become human, but you are not human. You are energy and light. I see you. I even feel you. Why is that not enough? I am still wishing for a fairy friend that can hold my hand and laugh and frolic gleefully with me. Please deliver these fairy people to me so we can explore and discover your enchanting world together. I get lonely and scared sometimes, even though I know you are there. I feel a drip of fairy crystal clear fluid squirt into my eyes. You cleared my vision so I can see properly all that you do bring to me. I'm sitting with a fairy friend now, writing about you. Laughing together in joyful delight, I have many fairy friends in human form. Thank you, fairies. 
for illuminating my vision so I see what's right in front of me. You truly are a gift, each and every one of you. I feel the fairy flutters glide inside my chest. You love me too. I feel your presence and love. I know we shall continue playing every day of our precious lives. This relationship is not built for the faint of heart eyes. For if I ever do forget, I'll call upon my inner child's essence to remind me what I've been missing and to reopen my vision to see with fairy eyes.